Here we go. Maybe the reason we work together so well is because he, his style of piano is my style of guitar playing. Always been. When you've grown up listening and loving somebody's music, it's really it sort of means so much more somehow. The resonance is much more than if you if it was a person of my own generation. When I was young, I used to listen to Jose's guitar style and, and think that's really I'd love that finger picking nylon string guitar. I mean, he plays all sorts of guitar, but that particular way, I just loved the way he did that. But I thought, how does that work with me, and how does it work with a big band? Well, it turns out it works great. So mean, you're the meanest old woman that I've ever seen. I guess if you say so, I'll have to pack my things and go. Yeah. We did hit the road, Jack. Um, but I can hear in Jose's playing, he plays in this way that is just like when you hear Ray Charles play, he's got this, this syncopation and this like sort of real the groove is something you can't quite put your It's like capturing lightning in a bottle. Back on my feet someday. Understood. You ain't got no money, you're just no good Well, I guess if you say so yeah. I'll have to pack my things and go That's right, hit the road, Jack And don't you come back no more, no more, no more, no more Hit the road, Jack And one of the and things I realised about, which I learned from Jose just by listening to him was that, it, like, this is early on, that, you know, you could play any sort of music You didn't have to say, well, I just play this sort of music, I just play folk, I just play blues, or I just play jazz. It's all, it's not, there's no point in any barriers. You just have to sort of listen to all sorts of things and find out what connects with you. Let's find each other tonight. Everything will be all right. Don't hesitate now. Let's find each other tonight. And if you need some company, Stevie Wonder's Treat Myself, which is very obscure. I just always sort of love that song, and Jose agreed to do that. And again, as soon as he starts playing and singing, it sort of comes to life. I can go where the and I'm feeling... He was on the Jubilee concert, and I said, oh, we're thinking, I said, I've always wondered, I'd love to cover that song. He said, please do. I said, oh, I said it's a bit, got a lot of chords in it. He said, don't worry about it. He said, you might please do, because nobody's done it. He said, you could do that great. And then he walked off. So I hope he hears it and likes it. I hope so too. There are no musical barriers for us. You play, you just you just put something in front of him, and he just makes it. He just makes it sound better. Whatever he plays on, it becomes a better thing. And then on top of that, of course, you've got Jose's wonderful voice. They say it's a singer, not the song, and I think it's true because Jose has done a lot of songs over his career, which I've enjoyed, and I've heard the songs before, but they pass me by. But when he sings them or plays them, I love this song. But I think that's the great thing. I think that's the gift of a really great singer. And that's what I was able to give up everything just to be home with you. Some of Jose's songs are wonderful. Now, for instance, Feliz Navidad is like a, a very famous one. But the great thing about that song is it's like one of the classic songs of all time because you could do it in lots of different styles. And so I said to Jose, look, you know, my, our band, part of it is we're like a ska band, you know, and I don't know how that's going to sit. So he said, well, let's just try it and see. So with the big band live down there, we, we, wrote, out, we wrote out a ska arrangement. And it's just great, you know, it's fantastic. Every time.